Hello, let's take a look at clustering in Tableau version 10. Imagine you're a company in the tourism industry looking for new markets. Possibly you're going to focus on senior tourism. Countries which have an aging population, maybe with high disposable income, could be looking for interesting new holiday opportunities and you as a company want to find them. Well, here's a map using the World Indicators data set that ships with Tableau. And I'm showing life expectancy of male and females, urban population, the, the amount of tourism per capita, and the amount of pe people in that country over 65. What groups exist in this, in this data with these measures? Well, all we have to do is drag the cluster onto the view. Tableau is using a k-means clustering algorithm to create these groups. There's plenty more about that in the documentation if you want to go find it. Let's see what we can do. Tableau's found two clusters, uh, but maybe we want a few more and want to segment our market into maybe four clusters. So we have four different clusters, cluster three, uh, cluster four, cluster three, cluster two, and cluster one. We can look at the detail of those clusters in a little bit more detail. Maybe we want to keep the clusters by creating a dimension from them. I'll put it down and leave it with its default name. Now we can draw a table and bring the clusters in and look at those five measures to see what the clusters are statistically like. Life expectancy of male and females, urban population, population over 65 and tourism per capita. What we can see is that cluster four has the highest life expectancy of males and females, but not the highest population over 65 plus. Also has a very high urban population and a pretty high level of tourism per capita. So this is interesting. That cluster has people in it who are expected to live a long time, but they've not all got into that 65 year old age bracket yet. So it's certainly a future market we could look at expanding into if we were this tourism company. So cluster four is kind of interesting. And if we keep only cluster four and look at which countries they were, then here we go. Here are the countries, the 15 countries that Tableau found in using the clustering algorithm based on life expectancy measures, urban population, tourism, and life expectancy. Maybe these are the countries we could go and do some focused marketing on to try and tap into the senior tourism market. That's clustering in Tableau 10. It's as easy as drag and drop. Then you can play with those clusters to find out much more about them and do further analysis on them.